I'm Howard Phillips Lovecraft, and today's question comes from a young person who wants to know my answers to the most frequently searched questions about myself on the Google Panopticon service. It seems that uh, when you people have a question these days, instead of uh, going down to the library or writing a letter to a responsible adult, instead you, you pick up your closest electronic device and you begin to tap away the question into this uh, rather innocuous looking bar. And if that weren't strange enough, as you type, it begins to fill in the query based on what other people have asked and its own nefarious agenda, I have no doubt. Now, when I received this question, I felt a bit like a genie who was receiving a wish for more wishes. It seemed an easy way to cram in a whole bunch of questions into one missive. But then I realized that if these are the questions that most people are asking, I have a responsibility both uh, to the public and to posterity to provide clear, concise responses and clear up any misinformation that might be floating out in this digital space. So let's go ahead and have a, a rapid fire, if you will, and just see what people want to know about me. All right, is H.P. Lovecraft, ah, is H.P. Lovecraft public domain? Um, no. I'm a person. I have wants and dreams, hopes and fears. I'm not a piece of fiction or creative work. As such, I want to be treated with all the dignity that being a human entails. Now, if you're asking, are my stories public domain? Well, to quote the Bard, the short answer is a yes with an if, the long answer is a no with a but. Next up, is H.P. Lovecraft good? This is a very serious ontological question that really gets at the heart of both humanity and the nature of the cosmos. What do we mean by good? Is anyone good? Are we talking about my actions or my state of being? You know, I'm just going to say no. Just going to say no. That makes it nice and easy. Ah, is H.P. Lovecraft alive? This depends on who you ask. Obviously, I have a certain amount of uh, bodily autonomy, I have an ability to move and engage with the world, but I have died. And whether or not my deadness persists is really, again, a philosophical question. One thing I do want to clear up is that I am reanimated and not undead. So if anyone accuses me of being a zombie or a vampire, you can clear that up right away. Not undead. Is H.P. Lovecraft hard to read? Proudly so. And uh, finally, is H.P. Lovecraft his real name? Well, as you will know by now, I am Howard Phillips Lovecraft. H.P. Lovecraft was my nom de plume, a nice way of standing out amongst all the other writers out there. So there we go. There are some of the questions most frequently searched. Luckily, none of them are about cats. As always, I'm Howard Phillips Lovecraft. Thank you.